is Charlie. Uh, this morning woke up, put on my laptop at work, and um, my screen just went dim. Right now, it's it's really dim right now. Um, I'm just trying to figure out what the pro what's the problem. And as I work for it, I'm just gonna see. You know, when I get it, looks like it's it's a it's a, it's a very a very open problem on the web on, on online. There's a lot of people online that's looking, you know, trying to figure out what's what's going on. I actually went this morning and pressed um, to bring down my screen just very early. My eye was it's just kind of too bright for my eye, and I tried to bring down the screen right here, and it's showing that you know you have access to bring the screen up and down, but there is no, it's not doing anything. So I'm thinking it's, it it might be a driver issue. So I'm gonna try to fix that problem, and while I fix it, I'll just make a video to hopefully can help somebody out there. So what I'm doing now is um, I'm reinstalling some older drivers that I found in my VGA. Um, I went through my D drive, and, I, and, I, and I'll show you if the, if it work. I'll, I'll go back for the process if it work, and it seems like it's working. And I walk and I walk back for the steps. It it getting brighter right there. So yes, uh, it worked. So I walk back through, and I don't want to do it for it to. And I think what happened is, um, a newer driver must have been must have installed itself on there, automatically or something, um, for an update. And I think that caused some problem in there because I'm, I'm running um, Windows 8.1 on there so that might be one of the reasons but some people have, have have been having that problem for a while but I think it's just a matter of the driver you install a driver installing itself and it's probably too new for something or whatever so there's a conflict somewhere in there I'm gonna click to start later to finish, but it worked. And, and, and now let's show you what I did. Walk back through. Let's see if I can walk back through the process. Okay, so what I basically did was this: I went into my my D drive and then driver. And then you go down into VGA down here, Intel 64, X64. And you will, that, that will come up. And then you will just click on Setup. So I click on Setup. It's going to ask you, and you're going to say yes. And then it's going to walk you through the process. And I, I think that's the one, yes. And then it's gonna run. It, it's gonna it's gonna ask you whether you want to. Um, it's gonna tell you that you are running a newer a newer drive driver on there, and whether you want to go back to the old driver. And you're gonna say yes, and you're gonna pick the old driver and go back on there. And since that I had already done it, didn't I guess it didn't ask me again. I should have keep the video running. But it didn't ask me again, so, and I think that's one of the problems that that that, that we're gonna we're gonna encounter. You know, it happens every time. You know, there is a change in um in the Windows OS, and we're gonna see. Uh, no, I'll fix that later. But it fixed, so right now you can see. I have I have um, the access, and this happened out of the blue. I I came in this morning, and I tried to. The screen was too bright because I had just woken up, and I tried to bring down the screen a little darker because it's too bright for my eye, and my my eye was taking time to adjust. And when I brought it down, just a little bit, it just went darker and stayed there. And I was like, what the hell? I was about to, I was ready to bring it back to Best Buy, but. It's it's a driver problem. Uh, again, I, I hope this helped. This is Charlie. I'm out.